Hello guys, Scott Fratcher from the Yacht Orion, 90 foot catamaran in charter. And uh, it's Katana brand, which means that we're the uh, largest Katana ever built with a flagship for Katana, which is uh, which makes me quite proud to be, to be on this boat. And today I'm talking about the 10 best things about Orion, the 10 things about Orion that I think are just spectacular compared to other boats of similar size. And so number 10, or... <laughs> Number four of the 10 things is the interior. So I'm going to talk about the interior from a couple different levels. First of all, the interior of Orion is really quiet, really, really quiet. And so that's because, uh, well, for one of the reasons is that they put Alcantara overheads. It's kind of like a uh, synthetic suede. And so that's the ceiling, the overhead, the ceiling of the boat. And what that does is it really knocks down the sound. It increases the insulation and removes sound. And so when you're sitting inside the boat and people are talking, the sound isn't echoing off all the walls. Now, normally what you end up finding is that a boat that's going to be put into charter, they, they don't like using Alcantara. They don't like using any of these... Uh, these kind of natural fibers because they're harder to clean. What they want are plastic walls, plastic overhead, plastic floor, plastic, 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 and just white plastic sheet. And then people can come in and clean that really easy and it's quick and, and uh, makes turnarounds really fast. Whereas boats that are going to be for private use, private, uh, private yachts, then they start going into putting in this Alcantara. They start coming in with this sound deadening. They start using things like leather interior, which is what they did with Orion. So even though we're in charter, we still have a lot of these, a lot of these comfort level items that would normally be uh, reserved for private yachts that aren't in charter. So we're kind of lucky that we get that we get kind of both sides of this, and so. And then, besides the quietness of the boat, the woodwork on the interior is just spectacular. The fits and the joints are just so precise and done so well. And, they, and none of the joints have opened up. And none of the joints have uh, formed cracks, for example, which oftentimes you see as boats start to get a little bit older. The, uh, the boats themselves start to move around a little bit. In the interior, there was just kind of like done to get the boat out of the factory. You know, that the wood starts to shrink and swell and you start to get all these cracks in the joints. None. None of them on Orion. You walk around and it's like, it's like, I mean, this boat is now, she was built in 2007. This is 2016. That's nine years old. And she looks as good as she looked on the day that she was built. We could go to, even though like I'm sitting here now, if there was a boat show in three days, I could just go over to the boat show, do a quick wipe down, and that's it. She would be boat show ready. And most boats aren't like that at all. Most boats you would be calling in the varnish guys beforehand and fixing up all the places where the varnish cracked up. And there'd be, there'd be all this stuff that you would have to do, whereas Orion is really a low-maintenance interior, except for about the only things that we do are... And <laughs> listen to that. That's the uh, water maker going into auto flush. That's what that beep is in the background. And so... So what that means to you as, uh, as the user is that you get to live in this absolutely beautiful interior space and it just kind of maintains itself. We wipe down the varnish with vinegar and, uh, and run the air conditioning enough to keep, the, uh, to keep the boat dehumidified and that's about it. Other than that, the boat just kind of, the interior just kind of takes care of itself and I really like that in a boat that doesn't take a whole lot of effort to keep the interior uh, maintained, which means to you... Uh, if you if you happen to have a boat like this, that means uh, less money spent on interior maintenance and less effort, and all that effort can get put someplace else, where because uh, boats always need something, so we get to put that something somewhere else. Okay, so that's it. Number four, interior. Love this interior.